Hi, and Dave King here from Affiliate Marketing Biz Ops, and thanks for requesting this video. Um, what I want to do in this video is show you um, how to search properly for your perfect clients. Your avatar, there is a difference between your perfect avatar and your perfect customer. Now, the difference being is your perfect avatar is the demographics and psychographics of their interests, their age, um, whether you resonate with them, um, and digging deep into to, to, to sort of writing everything down you can about what your perfect customer, uh, your avatar needs, um, and if it fits with your beliefs and um, what, what it is you're looking for in working with or who you can help. Your perfect customer is taking your avatar outlay so i mean i i my my perfect customer is a, a a male called bob and a lady called barbara now i have their age from um mine's probably from about 40 up to about 65 um purely because of what i teach and what my academy teaches um their interests are they don't have to be affiliate marketing um, there's two types of um people that you want to attract now there's the people that which i'm going to go to, into more in, in, in detail in a minute there's the people that are already in the whether whatever coaching you're in um or whatever affiliate program you're in there'll always be someone you want to attract that sort of kind of person so using your avatar you're searching these people okay so i'm gonna go over onto my uh, facebook live in a minute and i'm going to show you what to look for in your avatar type people um and how to get a feel if they're the right fit for you so that is the the perfect customer and the avatar you're using your demographics your psychographics of the people what their interests are their age do they resonate with you you should really you know so many gurus out there um, old hat selling it worked a couple of years ago tell you just go out there and add 50 a day and people just get click friendly and they're totally you're building the wrong audience what you need to do you need 50 to add about 15 to 20 a day but spend a couple of hours doing it really searching their profiles and i'm going to show you now i'm just going to pop over to my facebook live i'll see you over there hi and welcome back um so i'm i'm here on my um my profile page um and what i want to look at first um which is a big no-no with a lot of gurus who, who who basically say that if you use the Facebook recommended ones, the ones here, um, which are the people you may know, that you're not getting, um, you're not searching the groups, you're not finding the right niche, they're not going to be the right sort of people, which is which is absolute rubbish. Okay, I have got um, sales, many sales from um, recommended and finding people that are looking for help resonate with my avatar. And um, I'm going to go deeper into to how I'm finding these people, what to look for when you're choosing your avatar. As, a, as I say, you've got to be um, very um, choosy um, who, you, who you add to your friends list because you don't want a friends list of the wrong audience you know people might have an avatar that are selling high ticket affiliate marketing and they've got like um, their their age groups from like 30 to 50 and they're adding 21 year olds because they because they said they like affiliate marketing and they're probably got about 120 friends who have been um, they're either doing very well um, don't need your help um, or they're being battered by some of the bigger ones. Uh, they've got about 20, 30 friends who are on some of the bigger programs who are just going to jump on them straight away. So the first thing I do when I'm doing this, I always go, um, I always search from about minimum of three to four mutual friends 
obviously the age. So for this case, we're going to use, um, let's, let's pretend my avatar is 30 to 50 year olds. Um, the arrive at in affiliate marketing, but we're going to be able to tell if they're, they're sort of starting off. Or they are looking to get in some form of business online. Um, but then, you know, it doesn't have to be an affiliate marketing. There's two types. There's uh, people that you want to um, try and attract or try and help. The people who are doing it, doing something online already, have their own business, but they're not getting the leads, the results they want. They're not getting proper engagement. I don't just mean the Happy Tuesday, the um, great post, um, things like that. I don't. That's not engagement. Engagement is literally engaging in your posts, getting the right in front of the right audience, and down the line, using this in your content to, to get them to put their hands up and do your cold messenger outreach um, with. So... What we want to do is I tend to go down the list. Um, so it, he's got four friends. Let's have a look at Nigel here. Um, now, Nigel's more into hypnosis. Um, it seems that he's, yeah, he's pretty settled on hypnosis. He's not really suited for my avatar. So I won't be adding him. Um, we've got Chris there. He's about 30 to 40. Um, he's got a little family, 16 mutual friends. This could be a, um, this could be a goer. Um, so what we want to do is look at here, always look at their bio. And what you're trying to look for in the bio is anything to do with like affiliate marketing, if it's affiliate marketing, um, business. Um, the ones I do stay away from, and I think people that know me, know that I do not work with anyone to do with crypto, Forex, or Bitcoin. I stay away from them like the plague. I have have got a couple of lovely friends, but most of them don't want to talk to you, don't want to know you. They're just about themselves, and they're spam, spam, spam. Let them go and get their fingers burnt. It's up to them, but I don't personally add them. So I have a little look down here. Um, is sharing business stuff. Now, what you want to look on here as well, how many people they've got, how many mutual friends. So we all know it's got about 16. So um, this fella is interested in on, online because the, these people are sort of in the online business, but it be affiliate marketing or coaching or whatever. Um, you want to have a quick look from where they're from. Um, I do recommend... Um, I do recommend the top five countries, certainly for my, depends where you're from in the world. I tend to um, do most of Europe, UK, um, Northern America, Canada, Australia, New Zealand. Um, that is just what my niche is that, you know, it might work for you doing South America, Asia. Um, but, you're, f f you know, for the program that I'm in, um, certainly investment wise, they, they tend to be the areas. So. <clears throat> excuse me great this is florida um he's got no links to any businesses on here so he's probably not doing anything organically marketing so maybe using ads he's got some business stuff here um let's have a little look down now what you want to do here is you want to do your due diligence now this is so important when you're adding friends you're trying to build a relationship with them um, that is intimate and based on trust. Now, we'll be doing in my training um, my two step um, power um, chat message generator, um, the two step two day, um, which is without fail the, the best way of adding people in the business, and which I learned from my mentor, who is arguably the best in the business. Um, so, but what that entails is that you're building a relationship for you taking them through steps. So you need to look at this and see if you would resonate with this person. If you feel you don't, it doesn't feel right, you, you couldn't strike up a conversation, then don't add them. You've got to be ruthless with this. You've got to be disciplined with this. So this fella here, try this product today, it's amazing. Um, he's into sort of organics and health and fitness. Again. He's got a few funny ones. It's more about weight. It's, 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 it's not, again, resonating with my, um, with, 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 with what I'm looking for to, in helping people. Okay. It might be if you're in the health and 
fitness or, or bodybuilding it might be um, well for you so 16 right they've got no mutual friends no mutual friends let's just move on from these people so we want to go down the list a little bit you know you've got all these people here who i know are very good marketers a lot of them and he's probably doing well himself to have 43 friends it's down to you you can go up to 40 50 if you want but me personally i tend to keep it because i like the beginners and if they've got 20 odd friends they're they're pretty new as well so um i won't be adding any of them Let's have a little look here. Now, this could be, he's, I would say, between 30 and 50, five mutual friends. Um, so let's have a little look at Tim. So first thing we look at is, again, the cover. It's not very business-like. It's a lovely view. It's not very business-like. Um, he's got no, no links in here or, or bio telling what he does. Is he interested in business? Is he doing a business or has he got an inkling? Have you got an inkling that he wants to do? Sort of, you can help him. You can, you know, he might have any pain points that you could help with. Yeah, it's got a website. Just going to always have a little look, dig deep with this. So WordPress site coming soon. So fairly new to business. Um, now let's have a little look. Today's birthday is cheering a, a poor, little, poor little lass or lady um, or lad um on there now i want to make sure before i start doing my due diligence before i start engaging with him whether he's a fit for me then we're showing your family well now another thing you want to look at here obviously he's in america um he's he's employed um you want to look at the the rate that they're you know when they're last posting so it's quite recent it's the 19th today is it the 19th yeah 19th of august today this was on the 8th not very business-like. Um, God bless. Right, now, the reason I probably would add him is purely because he's of the right age. I could probably resonate with this fella. I quite like his posts. It, you know, it feels good. He's obviously quite new back in June, I'd say. Let's have a little look. Oh, February he's going back to. Um, Oh, he moved in June. Um, now, he's obviously got a coming soon. This is what has attracted me. The age, the fact that, you know, he's the sort of person I could, he likes sport, I like sport. Um, you want to find something that you could have a conversation and open that first message to him without being spammy or anything. Don't, you know, I with the way we teach chat messaging, we don't, um, we tend to not even go there with, um, we're, we're trying to build a relationship, trying to build trust, trying to get to know them. So you want to find something you can resonate with. Simpson, I have two grandchildren, and daughters, Krista, first baby, maybe they're kind of my little girl. So, you know, that's great family, lovely photo pictures, great for him. You'd like then like it. Okay. And then you want to find something. I, I suggest a couple of three uh, love hearts or use any of these. Um, when you're, when you're, you know, try not to use the like button. For some reason, Facebook doesn't, is not, whether it's a myth or not, I don't know, but you tend to get more punched with the algorithm if you use love hearts or happy faces, laughing faces, angry face, um, worried face or wild face. Um, so do two or three of them. I'm not going to do this because um, it's not really in my avatar because um, my age is, is slightly different than my 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 personal but we're going for affiliate marketing here we're going for um people that that, that could be in business he's already got five people there that are interested in business as well so i think them two facts have swayed me and um i am i am gonna um add i would add this person if this was my my avatar um so what you do you'd come down to here um, and then you'd look for something you can engage in disciplines of Jesus Christ um, well, I try and find something um, at the moment this um, you know you could watch this video 
and then comment on it just put in there um hi um tim <clears throat> and then you could put something like uh this is brilliant really uh great story i totally agree make sure you watch it first you know what it's about and then a little tip here is to add his name in so put at sign add the name so it tags him in and that way he'll see a notification up this up here that your name will already be in front of him. So it will show, Dave, you know, Dave King has um, tagged you in a, in a comment. Um, so that is a good way. So you can add this to your, 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 your sort of 15 to 20 people a day. You know, it's quite, quite a good one. Not perfect, but it is um, it's something you can work with. Then when you start to get talking to them, if they're not a fit for each other, you, you can always unfriend, you know, and that sounds ruthless, but you're here to run a business. Okay, so let's go to the next one. Just quickly get one more. So again, none of these have got any mutual friends. So they're probably not into. Let's have a look at Mark. I create word cell plugins. Also in anything marketing related. So another one. So he does the plugins. I do get a feeling straight away, though, here that he's gonna um just be plugging his plugins and this is what he does he plug is the um it, the email pirates yeah it's you know this is important as well look at what comments they're getting now people with baby pictures and the ones that put on countless rehashed um posts and happy to um inspirational saying quotes and and happy tuesday what um have a fad day post after post after post and not really in business um and the one that keep putting just complete spam like this they don't tend to get a lot of engagement now the ones that go through just going back the one uh, baby photos family photos animal photos um posts um happy tuesdays and um your inspirational quotes they will always 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 get a lot of engagement because they're easy targets for people that want to get their own algorithm up want to comment on something they don't have to read they'll put you know a lot of them will put great posts but if you're going to post something you're going to put something in you know in the comment in it put something a bit meaningful really resonate with this post um it, it, it's, it's something i use myself it's, it rings true with me don't just put a love heart you know but you only need to really comment on one or two things um I personally wouldn't add this. It's a bit, um, he's in the right area. He works at internet marketing, but a lot of people would add him just for that alone. I mean, he's he's pretty set in what he does. The reason he hasn't got any mini affiliate marketing friends, he has got a few, uh, because he wants to sell the plugins to them. Um, the reason he hasn't but is purely because his business is different to ours. You're probably not going to sway him. Um, you're not going to, um, you know, and it, instead of an improvement, a change of um, a change of uh, direction post, as it was. So you, you're trying to get people across to try something different that's not working for them. Okay, so again, I wouldn't um, wouldn't go with that. Let's have one more, and then we'll pop over to a group. Um, so we've got Jean here. She's roughly about the age we want. Um, do something to yourself. Thank you for. So she's into online. Um, very religious. Um, her, her, her love and her, uh, I don't even know if this is a business. It may be trying to help someone. Uh, the most patriot sunset I've ever known. God bless. I don't think this is really a business. It may be for her. Um, she may be selling these absolutely not for me um, I wish her good luck but um, wouldn't suit my avatar um, two seconds let's have a little look bit young so don't be tempted if you think they're a perfect avatar they're too young they're not your avatar okay they might be what you go for but they're not your avatar you need um, um, you need congruency with it you need um consistency with what you're doing phil may well could be 18 friends mm, no cover photo uh works at news watch 
Now he's putting on, um, I'm presuming he's affiliating these. Um, happy anniversary, lovely anniversary. So um, mutual friends got 18. So these, a lot of these are affiliate marketers. Um, so he's got an interest in speaking, engaging with people. We've got another one idea, another one here, which is like a three-day workshop mastery. So yeah, this is this is one I probably um I probably would add um for the for the avatar that we're working for. Um not getting many engagements on the business post, because the business post, when you get an engagement, then that you know when you're getting the right sort of people. Um, so two comments there. Um, you can still get on board. That's actually um, Pat comment in. So there's no comments on there. No one's engaging with this. It's just Pat putting these on. Simple video. Now, I might be wrong. He might be doing really well. Certainly not organically. This is really spamming. There's nothing there to say. So this would be a perfect one to add. So you go into here, you know, um, give them a like, um, put on a happy anniversary or love the flowers, have a fantastic day. Or you might watch this video, find something funny or, or interesting about it. Just put again, tag them in, just put a little note. So you know you're touching base with them. So you know, not like who is this person that's contacted you straight away. And then what you want to do is follow up in a couple of days or the next day when they've added you back as a friend. Never, never, never um, send them a message. Spam them with any of your links on the first conversation, but that is a different video altogether, different training. Some We go very, very deep into in the academy, and that's why it works for me and my students. Okay? Um, so the other way of doing it is doing your groups. I'm not going to go into groups now because that's, again – a whole different piece of the puzzle that needs going. But I'm sure if you're at this stage, you're in affiliate marketing or you're in online business, you know the group search is um, is essential. Okay, so we're just going to use ClickFunnel Avengers for this because it's an affiliates group. It's got a lot of people. Um, they don't tend to be my favourite, the, the massive ones. Too saturated and you t your posts and your engagement tend to get a little bit lost. Now, what you want to do, and what a lot of people do, is put things on here, like post things, like trying to dig things, like a post like who's struggling in affiliate marketing. Now, the admins of these, these groups are not stupid. They know that this is what people do today, and you risk getting blocked. So where you want to find um, – is, is where you want to sort of find the people you want is to look at um some of the quotes so some people would have um you know do do not give up for do do not give up before you even start seeing results trust the process agree um now people who answer them um probably aren't gonna um they they're not sort of they're just going to agree or they're going to go great post absolutely again so they're showing that they're, that they're in the group. So a great way of doing this is um, if you go to the search bar within the group and um, if we type in something like lead generation, something a pain, you know, people who have, one of the main pains is people getting lead generation, getting the right people um, to, to, to buy their products. And most importantly, um, have a solution that you can solve a pain that you can have a solution to so pop in there and then in this group you'll have conversations um, best social media platform mm, I tend to use um, I tend to use just Facebook anyway because it is the best for organic traffic uh, widely generation is important. Let's just have a quick read. Our VA is trying to set a VA. 10 month blueprint. I mean, starting a business here. Quick funnels. Let's have a look at this one. So, hi everyone. I purchased lead generation, so it's quite new. Does anyone have any recommendations? Um, so, this person being new, and that's full for me, but don't put that, it's only a couple of months ago. Don't let that put you off because he's still early in his journey. 
So Gary, um, around 30 to 40, I'd say. Some lovely Christmas jumpers there, Gary. <laughs> um, let's, let's, let's have a look at his profile. Now you want to look at their profile. Cash flow advisor, schools and churches, author podcast, does a bit of real estate. So I can't see any Bitcoin or Forex or any of that. Um, very much a family man, which is great. Um, he's got his Pfizer injection, good lad. Um, very much the family man. He obviously is interested because he's, you've already know that he's interested because he's in the ClickFunnels affiliates group. So that is that is the sort of um, that is what he's interested. It's one of his interested. He's obviously not doing organic. He's using funnels, but obviously we all know he use funnels in your organic training. He's got some educational leadership, so he's big into the educational side. Um, so, yeah, I, I personally look for my own personal avatar, a little bit young, but this would suit anyone sort of family, again, for dadpreneurs, um, 30, 25 to 40 year olds, family men, um, who want to, you know, because they're wise of their children, um, is from, um, is obviously from the States. Um, he's, you know, he's someone who can resonate, looks like a nice, nice fella, um, looks after himself, loves his family. But yeah, this could be a good one. So what you do, you've done your, due, you do your due diligence, due diligence. Um, you, you like a few things. Take your time liking it, though. Impress it, school district. You might like that. And then you could write this under here. Brilliant. I, I've had both of mine now. Good to see that they're getting rolled out. Stay safe. <clears throat> so you're building that intimacy. You're building that trust. So when, um, if he adds you back as a friend, um, you then go to your um, friends list recently added and these are all the people um that have recently added so you meet me mate now i use group track crm for this so i know and i'll put them as added then i'll put them onto the day that i added them but these people are the new people that have um come as my friends welcome if you're here um so you know that that you're, you're now friends with them you now can drop them um a, a first day um just a hi how are you doing um and then what, I'm not going to go too much into this a completely different video. And then you use your own chat messaging, what works for you. As I say, here at the Academy, we have, um, I, I teach my students the very best unsalesy way of, of chat messaging. But this is when you start to approach them. So, yep. So bear in mind, do 15 to 20 a day. Don't just add because you like the look of them or... You think, oh, they might be a fit, but they've got no interest in affiliate marketing whatsoever or whatever niche you're in. They've got no interest in starting a business. It doesn't have to be affiliate marketing. Look for their tagline. You know, um, if you if you look at mine, um, you know, I've got links on there. Obviously, the Academy. Um, I've. I'm showing a bit of authority there, organic traffic and sales coach, no BS, no ads, helping over 40. So I'm stating my niche there. I'm obviously pretty settled in. I'll probably, if you've been in the affiliate market space, I've got many, many, many friends in there and other. So you could, this is not a great example. Any you know, coaches, if you're new and looking for newbies, you don't want to be going for coaches. Um, you want to read there. Contents, I put that on yesterday. It's already got 24 comments. So, and these are business quotes. That's one with me, dear mum. Um, talk straight and post, mixed up posts. So, yeah, you probably wouldn't go for me if it's beginners. If you're a coach and you're looking for people that are earning over, you know, the high end um, who are quite established, I might be a good choice for you, but I've got too much on. <laughs> <laughs> at the minute but this you know this is for so this video is practically for beginners um and novices and people that are looking to improve their um finding the right people using the information from your avatar what niche they're in 
doing your due diligence before you add them as a friend and then follow up the next day. Um, just go back on, see if they post anything new, see if it's interesting. And that, that, that post will give you something to chat about on your first message with them. So you're not just going, hi, how's you, how's business, where you're looking to be in six months, how's COVID? That crap don't work anymore. That, uh, you, you know, this business changes, let alone every six months, every quarter. And doing this, getting to know them, building the intimacy, building the trust is what people are looking for. I hope this video has helped. It, 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 you know, if you stick to this, you will find you'll start building an audience of the right people for your niche, niche your avatar, your perfect client. You need to dig deep. You need to be sure what you're doing and be, um, be consistent with it. Don't be tempted to add people that you are nothing, you know, are, are not the type of person that you've got a solution to their problem to. Thanks ever so much for this video um, and have an amazing day.